So breast cancer is when you have abnormal malignant cells within the breast um, that grow at an abnormal rate. Some breast cancers are what we call localized, which means they stay confined to their ductal gland, um, and there are other invasive cancers uh, which will grow into the local tissue, and they can even what we call metastasize or travel to the local lymph nodes um, or even distant parts of the body. First and foremost, being female, uh, advancing age, family history uh, is key. Other things that we can control risk factors are postmenopausal weight gain and obesity, uh, excessive alcohol intake. Everything in moderation is key. So, you know, maintaining a healthy diet and lifestyle, uh, which includes regular exercise and activity, um, reducing your alcohol intake. Things to look for that may indicate that you have something abnormal going on uh, would be a lump that is new or increasing in size in your breast. Uh, you can have skin changes, which includes thickening of the skin, dimpling of the skin, uh, even a rash uh, that persists. Uh, you want to note if you have any changes in your nipple as well. Nipple retraction can be a sign of breast cancer and even abnormal discharges. So new discharges, uh, discharges from your nipple that are bloody, these would all be things that you should immediately contact your doctor and notify them of so it can be uh, taken care of. Tumors need to grow to at least two centimeters before they can be felt on a clinical breast exam. Screening has demonstrated that we can find cancers, even invasive cancers, that are much smaller than that, even less than a centimeter. Um, and the importance of finding them before they've grown to a certain size is they're very treatable at early stages. So breast cancer is a very treatable disease when we find it at an early stage. Currently, the American Cancer Society uh, screening recommendations are for women ages 40 and over to have uh, an annual mammogram as well as a clinical breast exam. So also, the American Cancer Society, there are some recommendations for 20-year-olds and 30-year-olds, which would be uh, to consider a clinical breast exam. So currently uh, at University Medical Center in New Orleans, we do offer uh, a new technology, which is called 3D Digital Breast Tomosynthesis. Um, essentially what it is, is a mammogram that's taken in multiple pictures. So it allows us to see through the breast tissue easier than we could with a standard 2D mammogram. So it